What's up, guys? It's Cody here with um, something a little different. Uh, today, I recently redid my HTC Evo. Well, it's been redid now for a month. I just haven't got around to, co uh, to installing custom ROMs um, because it was like messing up, staying at the loading screen and all this other shit. But um, so yeah, let me just show you here quick what I'm working with. This is uh, this is the lock screen, which is a little different from the HTC Sense launch screen. Um, I have the HTC Sense uh, widget here just because I like it. But um, so let's, um, this ROM is uh, very fast, one of the best ones you can find right now. Uh, the only thing that doesn't work on it would be um, the HDMI port, which none of us really use, so that's not really an issue. 4G works, WiMAX works. I'm not really sure what WiMAX is. I never heard of it before, but I'm gonna read about that tonight. But uh, so as you can see, it functions very well, very smooth. A lot, in my opinion, a lot smoother than. Uh, the operating system it came on, and then we also, uh, oh yeah, and this is also running on um, Android 2.3, which is gingerbread, I'm sure you guys are excited for that, but uh, I'm using the, uh, I can't even pronounce it to be honest, um, the Cyano Gen Mod, which is a custom ROM, this is version 7.0, um, RC2 for the HTC Evo. Uh, but yeah, I suggest um, you guys install this. It's a uh, very, very nice, um, very nice ROM. I was a little hesitant at first because I had some bad experiences with rooting, but um, it's it's just overall really nice. Uh, you, um, I installed it from the SD card. Um, let me just show you here quick. I'm just going to reboot one more three. That's pretty much it. Uh, so if you guys are thinking about rooting, I highly suggest doing it. Um, really, for the Evo, it's really simple. I just was messing up the first few times because I wasn't following that how I was supposed to. But other than that, it's pretty easy. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching.